Tim from the Overnight Guru team here at Shopify. So if you see on the left hand side, you can click the customers tab. You uh, would click the add customer button. You can fill out all of their information here. So first name, last name, uh, contact info, their address, any notes that you want to leave about the customer, any tags specifically that you want to tag them with like, um, you know, the, let's say male or female or, or local or, you know, whatever tags that you feel would be, uh, would be helpful for you. So once you have your store set up and you have some orders coming in, you've added a few customers, you're going to see a list that's populated that looks something like this. So you can see here that uh, now that you have a few customers, we have one from California, one from Ontario, you can separate them by a few different criteria. You can uh, separate them by those customers who are willing to accept, uh, you know, um, newsletters and stuff like that from you, females, males, geographical areas. Uh, and this is really helpful for, uh, you know, promotions that you're running, let's say uh, just south of the border or north of the border, or if you have uh, like a sale on menswear that's coming up and, and you only want to reach your males, you can filter that out and uh, make sure that only uh, Colonel Mustard and Billy Jean get the appropriate emails. Uh, so the other thing that you can do, the last thing I'll mention here, is an export or import of your customers. The import feature is particularly useful if you're migrating from another platform onto Shopify. So you have you know, a, a customer base of 500 people and you don't want to lose all that information obviously. So if you click import, what you can do is choose a CSV file uh, that uh, you can import into your store and that'll make sure all of the data uh, you know, carries over and you don't lose any of that customer information. You can also export your customers, whether you want to do that to uh, you know, back up your customer information or export them to uh, import somewhere else like in a, a mailing list or something like that. Uh, you can use this feature to export your customers and uh, it'll save to a CSV file that you can upload elsewhere. So that's basically it. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, a lot of cool features on this customers tab here. And uh, thanks for, uh, for tuning in.